What is up, scent heads, smell beast, and frag freaks? It's your boy. My name is Mega Dave, and this is Oh So Fresh. Yo, what is good, Fresh fam? For everybody returning, I want to say thank you so much for being a freshie. It really means a lot. And if this is your first time here, welcome. As I said before, my name is Mega Dave. This is my channel, Oh So Fresh. I do reviews on fragrances that I absolutely love, and I hope that you love them too. If you do, give me two huge fresh thumbs up. That lets me know that you love the content. Also, think about subscribing up here and hit me real decent down in my bell end, giving it a good wallop. Go ahead. You can try it. It's absolutely free to hit that button. Boop. There you go. Doesn't it feel better? Now you're updated, and you know when I'm going to drop new bangers like this because who knows could be your favorite that i review next today we got another vintage resurrection series fragrance this one from the most sold men's fragrance of all time of course it's a flanker still nonetheless aqua de Gio from giorgio armani was a very popular fragrance and it made this flanker called ascenza but in the dua house it's called dua essence of water as I mentioned, Aqua de Gio, obviously almost anybody on earth knows about this fragrance. Giorgio Armani made a hit whenever he created this Aqua de Gio. Actually, I think it was Alberto Marias, but it was such a hit and it's still to this day i believe the most sold men's fragrance of all time everybody knows that aquatic notes it's just you probably remember your pop smelling like it or you wore it it's just it was a very good hit it's very very antiquated now so it's outdated but this one was a flanker of a flanker of a flanker obviously a ton of hits when you have a mega star like that you try to replicate that magic in a bottle this one is a very good one that came out in 2012 was quickly discontinued i don't know why i actually never did own this bottle because at that point i wasn't even thinking about the giorgio Armani aqua de joe or any of that you know i was on my niche train and all that it is a very good fragrance so let me just stop talking and get to why you guys all came here and get to the scent breakdown all right i got my dua essence of water and of course i got my handy dandy fresh strip and we're gonna put water to paper all right, we had a little technical difficulties, but we still got some juice. All right, this is very, very fresh. So the aquatic note that it opens up with is a very, very uh, cascalone note, which is used to simulate fresh water and those aquatic notes of cold water. It simulates that because you can't really extract oil from water, you know, unless you're off of the coast of Louisiana or Texas, in which case you can extract all you want off of BP and all that, but you can't get it, so you have to simulate it. The synthetic that is in here, obviously it's a synthetic, you can't get it, but there is nothing disgusting, nasty about this thing. It is very, very natural. Just smells like you have some water and it's poured into a cup and you smell it and it's the freshest that you can imagine, but with some twists. There is a very, very gorgeous citrus in here, a tart grapefruit, some very nice floral notes, and some bergamot as well. So imagine all of those together with the most fresh, cool water that you can imagine. This has a slight, slight, slight salt to it, but nothing outlandish or crazy or any of that. So it's just very, very fresh with some citrus in there, of course, to keep it all gorgeous. When we get towards the base, very fragrant uh, basil, basil for people in England and the UK, and a sage note as well. It is very, very fragrant. It definitely adds to this blend and keeps that freshness going and keeps this thing ever changing so it doesn't stay one dimensional. Also coming in is uh, some pepper note. It's a little spicy, but it's definitely in there for a purpose to keep the florals and all those herbs, herbs, at bay so it doesn't get out of hand here the pepper kind of reins that back in so it can keep its freshness while putting a little bit of masculinity in here as well 
and all together right now it's blended so so perfect and as always i got some on here musk and broxen again this is not uh like you're thinking of and broxen it is used for longevity in this to keep productivity up and keep this thing pumping and pumping but the ambroxan not super synthetic at all it's kept in check with a very clean vetiver there's some patchouli in here but definitely not an earthy patchouli whatsoever everything is clean and smooth the ride is just gorgeous it's like you're on super crystal clear water and you have some florals in your face and some citruses blowing it is a very very clean very nice fragrance also in there is a, a slight woody note it's uh cedary you know and then there's some still pops of that freshness through so that water just helps wash all of this down and keeps it very clean and very pristine fragrance and i know most people are thinking oh it's a super clean super fresh fragrance it's not going to last not true that's the reason for that ambroxid in there that's the reason for patchouli that i can smell in there and that wood in the base if you were to keep all those super fresh notes of course it would fizzle out and die but with those added notes i'm getting about seven hours brand new bottle of course and about an hour or so of projection this is not a screamer by any means but it is very very good in longevity I don't know what the old one was, but I can imagine it was probably less than what this is with Dua, and this is going to increase with time. I cannot wait to get this, to use this for spring, for summer. If we're trapped in the house, it's going to be all over my body. Hop out of the shower, put it on. It's going to feel like you just jumped out of a shower into another shower, a fantastic meteor shower of freshness. So for this gorgeous fragrance, comment down below. Let me know what you think of this fragrance. Do you own it? Do you want it? Do you need it? I do. It is a superb fragrance, and I am glad to have this in my collection. But till I come to you guys and girls again, I love you always. Be blessed and stay fresh. We got these shows on the flow.